Revelio. This may be a leap, but I believe I know who ended up with those pages. I'd be happy to take you to him, if you'd be so kind as to perform a small favor for me along the way. Hmm. Small favor in exchange for getting those pages. Yes, it's, it's nothing really. I'd be grateful if you could simply go into the kitchen and procure a little rotten roast. I beg your pardon. Roast beef. Rotten roast beef. That is correct. Rotten roast beef. If one floats through it just right, one can almost taste it. Mm. Ugh. I suppose I can do that. But why me? It's simple, my young friend. My ghostly form cannot carry it. Now, if you'd be so kind as to collect the roast beef, I shall explain everything else in due course. Ah, here we are. Tickle the pear and head on in. Did you say tickle the pear? Yes, in the painting. I'll wait right here. Uh, do try not to get in the way of the house. Revelio. Mm, I'm already imagining the sweet aroma of rotten roast beef. A student Never will in the kitchen. Students. What could they want? It smells glorious in here. Hmm. It's some beef, but it's not rotten. I'd best keep looking. Rebellion. Ugh, there's a disgusting smell. I must be getting close. Sounds lovely, but what? Ah! Think he supposes Nick's tired of lot. Do you and the other house elves conjure the food, sir? Goodness, no! Food is one of the five principal exceptions. Oh, we can't. Are there any restrict? Think he suppose. Her quins. Is it all right? Well, sit. there's nothing that lifts think we saw. It was nice to meet you. Happy to help. I've gained a new appreciation for breakfast. Revelio. Not at all. Finki sends her regards, along with them. Ah, glad to. Now, let's get that beep. This is all rather cryptic. Terribly sorry. I'm getting ahead of my... Sir Patrick or... Headless activities. Uh, yes. Uh, your... My plan is to take the rotten roast beef to... Uh, shall we? I thought the rotten roast beef... It is, uh, in a way. You see, I've been trying to gain access to the hunt for quite some time. Offering the beef to... What am I supposed to do when we meet the hunt? Allow me. I'm certain they'll be welcoming to you, however. In no small part, due to the rotten roast beef, you will come back. 
Is the Headless Hunt dangerous? Oh, the Headless Hunt wouldn't hurt a fly, let alone a student. Very well. I'd ah, wonderful. You won't regret it. Do stay behind me. It's a Patrick we want. Oi, Nesta! Look who's here! What have we told you, nearly headless Nick? Hello, Sir Ramsay. Do let us pass. We've brought a little something for Sir Patrick. Probably come to try to beg his way in again. <laughs> <laughs> Do they always talk to you like that? Ah, all in good fun. Once Sir Patrick lets me join the headless hunt, I'll be right there with them. This offering is sure to win him over. Uh, don't forget why I'm here, sir. Rest assured, you'll have your information from young Jackdaw in no time. Wherever he may be. What I'd give for a flagon of mead or a nice leg of lamb right about now. Then this party would be complete. How about the next best thing, Sir Patrick? Ah, Sir Nicholas. And a student. Who let you in? Uh, we brought you a gift. This is all very suspicious. What do you really want? As if I need to ask. Um, it, it's Richard Jackdaw. Uh, where can we find him? Uh, may we speak to him? Jackdaw, eh? Why, here he is now. What a shame. Without his head. I bet you've always wondered what that's like, eh, Nick? <laughs> <laughs> Sir, you jazz. <sighs> it's bound to be around here somewhere. Probably being used in a game. If you find it, I give you my permission to speak with him, my young model. <laughs> it's the least I can do for you for bringing this... Rebellion. <laughs> hmm, a map. It doesn't appear to be connected to the missing pages. Best hang on to it for now. A wonderful night for games. Who will be next to play our little game of hide and seek amongst the pumpkins? Hello again. Ah, St. Nicholas is young. Not at all. Indeed it might... Oh, why not? Not just once. Those are the rules. What say you? If that's what I need to do to speak to Jackdaw, I'll do it. Ma Remember! Begin! Cast away until you find him! I've never seen a place like Revelio. Like Discovered already? It looks like we need to find another pumpkin to hide it, eh, Jackdaw? Whatever you say, Dumfrey. This is not my Rebellion. finest moment. I could do that too if I had a wand. The end of party. <laughs> Jackdaw's no match for you. Who would have thought a mortal would be so good at this? You've almost got him. Oh, what fun! A student is playing! You have a good head for business, haven't you? I'm glad I won't be the one to clean up this mess. Thank you. 
No one can say I don't keep a stack shelf. I've never seen it played like this. How delightful. I could do that too if I had a wand. There's a body. No one can say I don't keep a stack shelf. I won't be the one to clean up this mess. Rebellion. It won't be long now. That ghost said I should blast away to my heart's content. Well done! Of course, having a wand served you well. Still, I believe congratulations are in order. Not too bad for a... Nicely done. But what's going on? You're not a member of the Headless Hunt. No, I'm not. Merlin's beard. The map on those pages led me to my demise. The pages are like... The pages are why you lost your head. And I must visit a cave and search for your corpse. Yes. <sighs> Say... What will I find in the cave? Aside from my mortal remains? If I remember correctly, some treasures, a magical bridge... But what kind of an adventure would it be if I spoiled the surprise? Did someone in the cave cut off your head? I was having a look around when I suddenly sensed a refreshing breeze, after which I felt, well, light-headed. That's all I remember. How is it possible to steal from Peeves, a poltergeist? I didn't steal the pages from his ghostly form. I merely found them in his wake of dis- He has a- I found them after he ran riot through the- I need those page- Not to worry. See you at the forest. Incendio!
Merlin trial when I see one. Repairer. Incendium. Let me also. Protego. Accio. Incendium. if I'm safe to explore in there.
This place has seen better days. Repairer! Nobody will miss one meat. Perhaps I'll come back to this. Shame you're so foul. Incendio. 
incendiary. They come after me. I'll stick them like a knock tail. even agree on something amongst ourselves, how on earth are we to forge a plan to defeat our enemies? <laughs> Stop right there! Hang on! Akiyam! Hey, the fable, that is! Akiyam! Amateur! Confringo! Did you learn that? Life dry! Learn that in fact! Think you can sneak away! Is that the best you can... Time to get my call? Afraid to take a hit, are you? Incendio.
Revelio. Incendio. You were able to take care of everything I had asked you to do. Professor, I completed all of your most recent assignments. Well done. Then you're ready to learn Expelliarmus. Pay close attention. The disarming charm may often be all you need to defeat the most powerful dark witches and wizards you might encounter. Spellcasting requires a focused mind and a steady wand. Dummy is here if you wish to stay in prep. Professor, do you have a moment? I do. What is it? I wondered, did you attend Hogwarts? I did. I am a proud member of Ravenclaw House. Why do you ask? I was curious as to how Hogwarts has changed over the years. I see. Well, the castle itself, as I'm sure you have surmised, is full of surprises. I dare say more than the staircases change around here. As for the students, well, they seem to get more capable every year. I can tell you, however, that I did once admonish a certain Phineas Nigellus Black for enjoying a sugar quill during a lecture. Uh, I, I hadn't realized that you and Professor Black were, uh, students here together. <laughs> Appearances can be deceiving. You see, I was once wounded by time itself. Time itself? 
I never would have imagined such a thing. Ah, well, it was the risk I took with my prior position. You may or may not have heard that I was an unspeakable at the Ministry for years. An unspeakable? What does... Uh, as you might suspect, I cannot speak about what we did. Suffice it to say, the job was not without its... Help. Now, I hope I've satisfied your curiosity for the moment. You have. Thank you for speaking with me. Keep up with your wand work. Expelliarmus! You seem to have the right end of the stick. Accio! Expelliarmus It's the right end of I see. someone would send me a Rebellion.
Mysterious and a bit unsettling. What to do? Accio! Incendio! Rebellion. Incendio. Levio. I hope you have your Incendio. 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 Slippery is Winder, no less. Incendio. Here I am, as good as my word. We meet again, Richard Jackdaw. I su- Well said. Now where do we- Follow me. I shall lead you as far- Keep your eyes open, as you can imagine. Aside from the bird bath, anything else I should look for? Indeed. A few landmarks, a stone bridge, a waterfall, and, if I recall, a lake. You'll see. You've been very helpful. Thank you. Surprising how much of this is rather unfortunately coming back to me. Hmm. Yes. You know, the closer we get, the more I'm remembering. Probably best I leave you to it. Simply stick to the path Rebellion. and keep a sharp eye out for that bird bath. Adieu. Levioso. Oh, Greek. Hmm.
How inconvenient. Let me open. The waterfall for a thief, Jack was surprisingly as good as his word. Ah, 
field. Something oddly solemn about this place. Such regal creatures, stags. There it is, just as Jackdaw described. Intramuros. Aren't you a little far from home? Renrock knew you'd eventually lead us to whatever it is you're hiding. Let us <laughs> oh, bury you in Loyalist will report back to Ranrock now. Let's see where Jack Doris led me. I wonder how big this place is. before they time out on me. Someone didn't want casual visitors down here. Rebellion. I wonder if any of my spells will help me through this. Incendio! Ah! 
here. Rebellion. Another puzzle. Well, if Jackdaw could solve this, so could perhaps the next symbol is hidden somewhere. the symbol. if I can move that platform somehow. Not a headless skeleton in sight. Hmm, but I may as well help myself to this. Akio! Richard Jackdaw left a little something behind for me, but where could he be? Thank you. 
Incendio. Incendio. Accio. Incendio. 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 That's odd. I'd have thought Jackdaw would have been interested in this loot, but there's no sign of him. Oh. Ah. 
It's a good thing Jackdaw didn't fall down there. Send it. Not a headless skeleton in sight. Hmm, but I may as well help myself to this. An untouched chest. Jackdaw wasn't very thorough in his search of this cave. Akio! I'm glad Richard Jackdaw left a little something behind for me, but where could he be? Jackdaw would have been interested in this loot, but there's no sign of him. Revelio. Yeah. 
Shield. Not a headless skeleton in sight. Hmm, but I may as well help myself to this. Untouched chest. Teradol wasn't very thorough in his search of this cave. Complete. Your spiders. These can't be what we're having to do. Rodego! Akio! Incendio! Akio! Incendio! is simply too many. Imagine how the spiders have multiplied since Jackdaw came this way. Jackdaw would have been interested in this loot, but there's no sign of him.
getting closer to Jackdaw's remains and those pages. We meet again, Richard Jackdaw. Thank you for keeping these pages safe all these years. Here it is. The map that brought your doom, Jackdaw. Hmm. Is there something beyond this room? I 
we've seen this before. The Gringotts and the restricted section. Where am I? Oh no, the room's starting to flood. How am I being protected? What sort of magic is this? I can only hope this magic protects me until I'm able to make my way out of it. What is this place? Can it be? Revelio. It's you. Has someone finally found our map chamber? I recognize you from the pensives. You're Professor Rackham. I am indeed. I must confess that I am surprised to see someone so young standing before me. I'm the same age that you and Isadora Morganark were when you started at Hogwarts. You've paid attention. And might I presume you share our ability? To see traces of ancient magic? Yes, sir, I do. As you have likely realized by now, our ability gives us a unique relationship with all forms of magic. We can access expressions of magic that few others can. Opportunities will arise that allow you... I won't, Professor. We have much to discuss, but for... I don't have the book with me, sir. Hmm. That is unfortunate. I'm afraid we must pause our conversation until you return... I'm a bit confused, sir. Why is this room called the map chamber? I assure you that all will be clear once the book has been placed on the pedestal. The statues and carvings in the house on the cliffside, those are of you. Are you a seer? I am. Did you know that... I cannot... Very well. Good.
I found the pages and the map chamber. Why would I need the book? I'm back at Hogwarts. I wonder when Professor Fig will be back. I did promise him I wouldn't neglect my studies while he was away. Suppose I have enough to distract myself with till he returns with the book. Rebellion! Accio! Also, the banishing charm. Useful for pushing objects or adversaries away. Complete the required tasks and meet me in my classroom. Oh, it was an accident! Ah, ah, ah. Everybody grab a broom, and we shall get started. Mr. Clopton, your attention, please. Sorry, Madam Kagawa. Everyone, please welcome a new student to our flying class. Welcome. Hello. The goal of today is to remind all of you how to maneuver on a broomstick safely, as broom flight is, first and foremost, a means of transportation. This, I fear, some of you have forgotten. Diving, rolling, and loop-the-loops will not be taught or in fact tolerated in this class. We'll leave that to professional Quidditch players, like the Toyohashi Tengu. Boo. Not a fan, I take it? Now, let's see how well everyone kept up with their practice over the summer holidays. For those who need a refresher, step up to your broom. Say up, firmly and clearly. Then kick your leg over and rest your weight on the seat. Up! Thank you. Now, your turn. Up! Up! Up, you stupid ratty school broom! Up! One leg over, so there's a leg on each side. None of that side saddle nonsense. A gust of wind will throw you right off. And if you hear my whistle while you're in flight, ground yourself at once. For your first lesson, fly through each ring in the courtyard. Do take care. Ah, the brooms are I think school I'm property. The of this. I want them returned in one piece. <laughs> this is brilliant. Well done. Now that you're acclimatized to your broom, let's see how well you manage with a more advanced exercise, shall we? This 
next set of rings will take you around the grounds. What a view! <laughs> Hello! Nice day for a flight! <sighs> that wasn't too bad. Ah, oh, the old boathouse. Wish you could have experienced crossing the lake as the first year. Aquatic resident likes to make an appearance once in a while. <gasps> Made it. Oh, did anyone else see that? <laughs> this is rather fun. I watched you fly through those rings. You seem to handle yourself on that dusty school broom well enough. I'd imagine you're ready for something a bit more challenging. But I'm getting ahead of myself. We haven't properly met. I'm Everett Clopton. Am I right in suspecting that a Gryffindor like you might be interested in a high-flying adventure? <sighs> Can't say no to that. What did you have in mind? A bit of a detour, so to speak. Follow me. The tour is about to begin. Follow closely now. Right now, we're flying over the Transfiguration Courtyard. Let's hope the Headmaster isn't having tea by the window today. Nice to get above it all, isn't it? Ahead of the gardens. The Hufflepuff common room windows just peek out. Bit claustrophobic for my taste. How is Everett flying so quickly? Here's something handy to know. Lean forward for a burst of speed. Helpful if you need to escape a tricky situation. Think of all now the magic holding like it, it up. I'm, you sure you're not part hippogriff? And the owlery. That's a bit of solid architecture, isn't it? Flying tips and a jaunt around Hogwarts. This is quite the tour, Everett. Have you two been? Oh, hello, Professor. We were trying to get a bit of extra practice in. Hefty points will be taken from each of you for not following my instructions. 
Mr. Clopton, I am disappointed in you. You're in this class because you're still because you're still not showing yourself, or frankly, your broom the proper respect. But Professor, enough. Class is finished for the day. As for you, you do well to use better judgment in the future. Chin up. That was some rather good flying. Sorry about that bit. It was worth. You seem at home on a broom. I could show her a thing or two if I had my own broom. Hate having to return the school broom after class. Perhaps I have to purchase a broom then. If you can, you should. Wish I could. I recommend visiting Albie Weeks at Spintwitch's in Hogsmeade. He's always looking to test new models. Revelio. I've not forgotten about our library venture. How did you fare? If you're keen for some illicit spell practice, meet me outside the Defense Against the Dark Arts classroom. I know a discreet place near there. Good day to you. I require assistance with a delivery and thought you might be interested. Please visit me at J. Pippin's Potions if you'd like to earn a few coins. Please meet me in the seventh floor corridor as soon as you can. I have an idea for somewhere you can focus on your studies, away from prying eyes and distractions. Hello, Mr. Weeks, is it? Albie Weeks at your service. Welcome to Spin Witches. Apologies if you came by before and weren't able to come in. Shop's been closed, and I've only just returned. Thankfully, got a few rare yew weavers available, ember wind wisps too. Sounds quite the array of brooms. I'll have a look around. Thank you. What are we looking for today? That item is of the highest quality. Item is of the highest quality. That 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 item is of the highest quality. Nice doing business with you. That item is of the highest quality. That item is of the highest quality. You'll be thrilled with that broom, I promise you.
whilst nearly any broom will certainly... You seem to be a flyer who might be interested in... Go on. <laughs> but you may notice that speed consistency tends to falter as you rise. I believe I have some ideas. What I need is... As it happens, another Hogwarts student, Imelda Rays, is using abandoned broom courses for time trials. Clever girl. An ideal situation I could complete. Why do you need me to report to you on this broom flight? I did. I need a flyer with... He's forever in it. If your room had talent... Sounds as if you took Kagawa's class. I did. But my focus on the technical elements of brooms rather than the art. She thinks it fit in. And I find the... With your help, I can... That sounds int... Thank you. The time trial should... Once you've beaten Imelda's time, be sure to let me know. Ah, I can't help but admire Mr. Weeks' enthusiasm. Does it get any more cosy than Hogsmeade? Hey, you, Gryffindor. I can't seem to master the Wigan World potion. Stirring techniques at all. <laughs> Amelda Rays? I'll be. <laughs> Did he now? Still take. I tried to help him once. He nitpicked my flying technique, and that was the end of that. Why is he roping you into his broom testing silliness? Caught wind of you showing off and... Seems someone's jealous of my skills on a broom. Me? Slytherin Quidditch captain. Jealous of you. Everyone knows that class is only for beginners, troublemakers and... But for some reason, now people think you're competition. Ugh, I can't be having that. Perhaps... You're not even Slytherin. Could be a useless squib for all I know. Enough of this. I hold one of the fastest times on this course. Let's see if you can beat it. Slytherin versus Griff. I actually don't have time for this right now. Perhaps another day.
Hello there. Perhaps you can help me. I don't find potions bearable at all. Rebellion. Accio. Professor Weasley? Hmm. Somewhere away from prying eyes. Master stopped me and I... Merlin's beard. I see you've wasted no time. Well done. Shall we? After you, Professor. What is this place? This is the Womb of Requirement. It only appears when one is in real need of it. Ordinarily, a student might stumble upon... Audio jump.